I was going to go through all these static methods of array, but then I realized these are kind of straightforward, and most of the time we don't use these anyway because we have their link counterparts on the right, and the link counterparts are much more convenient, much more versatile. Remember, these functions came into existence before link, so these functions, even though they're not deprecated, they're not necessarily as useful. So there's the sort function, which will sort all the elements in place in the array. So your actual array, all the items inside the array will be sorted. And link has an order by, which will return a new sequence instead. It will not modify your input sequence. So you can use sort, or you can use order by. In fact, let me actually demo that really quickly. I have ints here. That's for each. And I and ints. Calls the right line I. You see our ints here printed in the exact same order we have them in RAM. I can say array.sort ints, control F5, and we have our sorted ints. The elements inside the array must be iComparable. I'll talk about iComparable in a different video. But ints are definitely comparable because you can see, oh, 2 is less than 5, and 0 is less than everything, 1 less than 8, so on and so forth. So sort actually modifies these ints in place inside of our actual array instance, whereas order by, let me do a link order by here. I'll say var sorted gets ints dot order by. Order by requires a key to order by. And so I'll say, hey, order the ints by their actual selves. It may look a little interesting to you, but if you watch my link video, I can't remember what I stored in there, but I could say person dot first name like so. So that's why order by takes a, a an argument, a lambda expression. Anyway, I don't want to belabor the point here. Let's just order the ints as they are, and that'll be sorted. So when I right line and for each on my ints, you can see the ints maintain their original order. But if I put sorted in here, sorted is a new sequence, which is definitely sorted. So that's sort versus order by. Order by is a link function, whereas sort is a static function on array. Let's look at the rest of these. There's for each. I already showed you for each. Index of will find an element. Actually give you the index of the element you're trying to locate first. Doesn't give you the index, but it'll actually give you the actual object you're looking for. And this is a link function. All these on the right are the link counterparts. Clear, clears the array, not very interesting. Copy will copy the array. We've seen copying arrays earlier in here. Create instance is kind of interesting. I've never had to use it, but if you look at my reflection video, I do a lot of reflection and dynamic stuff at runtime. Same idea with create instance. I don't have to say new int array. Instead, I can have a type and pass that type into create instance and dynamically determine the type of the array I'm creating. Again, go watch my reflection video. Exists will tell you if an element exists in the array that you're trying to find. I could say, hey, uh, does 8 exist in my array? Uh, does it not exist? That kind of thing. Link has an any. Does the exact same thing. Find. I already talked about first. First will find the element that I'm looking for, but first is much more robust. Go look at my link playlist if you want to learn more about that. Find last. Same as find, except it's going to find the last. Find all. Uh, we have a where clause. One of the first things we use in link is where. Go watch my link videos. Find index, find last index. These are pretty straightforward. Resize. We already talked about resizing array and adding grep onto the array. Resize just does that extra overhead for you. And then reverse. There's actually a link reverse. So you could use the built-in one or the link one. I'd probably favor the link one just for consistency. But there you go. There are all the static functions. Sorry, I'm not going to take the time to demo them because I think there's more relevant, more cool things we can look at.